gosh, I just got bit by something. It was a big sand flea, I think. A big sand flea? Yeah. for a beach day? Okay. Getting all packed up for the beach. Are you ready, boys? You ready to go have some fun at the beach? I will go on both of my toes. Keep going. Watch where you're going. Rory, are you getting your sunscreen on? Yeah. We gotta protect ourselves. Yeah. It's so windy out today, we need to put a ton of sand inside of this little pocket to keep the tent from blowing over. What's up guys? It is Smelly Belly TV. And if you're new to the channel, my name is Tara, the mother of this crazy crew today. It is just Jesse and I and Rory and the puppies because Jayla and Ada are off with their friends at a different beach. And um, actually, if you're new, I'll just give a little background really quick. We've been living in Florida for two years now. We lived in Minnesota for eight years before that, but now we're in sunny Florida and we go to the beaches quite a bit. The main one that we usually go to is super crowded today because it's our first really, really, really hot, hot day in a, like a month or so. So that one was super crowded and we had to drive a little ways to get to this other beach and we brought Rory's truck along as you can see. She loves driving that around the beach. However, we forgot that there are many, many steps that we have to go up and down before we can get to this beach. So Jesse and I had to haul the truck up and down and all of our stuff up and down and the puppies up and down. It was a lot of work to get here, but now we're relaxing. I'm just happy that we made it and I just can't wait to spend some time. I really do wish Jalen and Ada were here though. I'm missing them. They actually have been gone since yesterday. They had a sleepover last night and they're spending the entire day at the beach with their friends, but I'll get to see them tonight. So it's all good. They'll be back in my life. It's nice to get breaks from each other because then you realize you learn to miss each other. When you're together all the time, it can be kind of tough and you get on each other's nerves sometimes, especially for us because we homeschool. So we are all together 24 seven. We work together, which is YouTube. We do homeschool together. Then we also try to just have family time beyond school and YouTube, which is a hard task as well. So it's like we're always together. So we need space. We all need some space sometimes. And that is a normal and healthy thing. Benzo, I see you've already been eating sand. He loves to eat the sand, guys, but he has his face full. You're going to need a bath when we get home. Where's my Frenchie boy? Franco to Frenchie. It's so cute that I call him Frenchie boy and then he comes. You're so sweet, aw. Are you being guard dog? Are you being a little guard dog? I have Enzo Benzo tied to the tent here, guys, because I know he's not strong enough to blow it away because he's so light. But if I were to put Franco tied to this tent, it would be torn down in a second if he got excited and decided to take off running. Only the finest of water for our pups. That's right, smart water. <laughs> they get nothing but the best. Nothing but the best. All boys enjoy. They get so thirsty, guys, especially Enzo. He loves water. He can drink it and drink it and never stop. But we have to be careful with Franco because if he drinks too much too fast, he'll puke it all up. Do you guys think Franco will eat a piece of broccoli, yes or no? Let's try it out. Oh, he likes it. All right, Benzo's turn. Will Benzo eat it? Oh yes, they both will eat broccoli. Oh, Franco's spit is out, but he's trying to get it back up. Franco, you have strong jaws, buddy. You can chew through that like a beast. Guys, look at Enzo. What is he doing? He's eating his broccoli. Like he picks it up and tries to shake the sand off. <laughs> and then he drops it again and licks it. And then he keeps doing it over and over again. <laughs> his broccoli flew out of his mouth. I'm gonna tell you guys a little secret real quick. Enzo got into the hummus a little, like one little lick, and but I'm really, really hungry, so I just scraped off the top of it. Is that gross? But I'm really hungry, I still wanna eat it. I think by scraping off the top, I removed all of his stinky puppy beard germs, because he gets a stinky, stinky beard. Rory, are you stuck? Yeah. Did the Bellians help you out? Yeah. All right, Bellians, let's push. Okay, floor it, floor it. The Bellians will push you. All right. Are you upset? Are you upset? Her, her truck got stuck, guys, and she's saying, who put the sand here? Who put the sand there, huh? Can you believe that somebody put sand on the beach? That's just nonsense. Why would somebody put sand on the beach? Do you think it came from the ocean? The ocean did that. <laughs> you want me to push you? Yeah. All right, let's go. Bellions will help you. 
Are you ready? All right, go. Watch where you're driving, kid. Don't hit anybody. There are so many shells on this beach, and Rory is trying to tough it out by walking on the shells. Okay, there's the sand. All right, she made it. Franco, grab the lawn chair. Franco! I totally forgot that he was tied to it and I stood up to help Rory get a snack and he took off the chair. <laughs> I got Rory this Lunchable and what's the first thing she goes for? What is it? Reese's. Reese's? She yeah. even knows what type of candy, guys. Fun fact about Rory. Let's eat it! She is a chocoholic. I know Rory loves me if she's willing to share her chocolate. She said I can have a tiny bite. Mm. Can you guys see that tiny little bug on my pants? They are all over the beach, and I don't even know what they're called. I think they're called I think they're a, sand a sand flea. But he's so tiny, and he's crawling all over me, and I can barely feel him. It's kind of weird that I can somehow feel him through my clothes. Oh, there he goes. He flew away. They get pretty annoying when they get on your skin because your skin just starts, like, not quite itchy and, like, not quite... I don't know. It's it a weird like feeling. Feel, yeah, it feels like your skin is crawling. So it like kind of itches, but it doesn't. Frankie, get out of my energy drink, boy. He is such a big baby. I love him. That's a fly, baby. Where? Oh, you got him. Oh gosh, I just got bit by something. It was a big sand flea, I think. A big sand flea? Yeah, it was a big one. Got me good. It got you? Got me good. Rory eats her Lunchables very uniquely. First, she eats all the meat. Yeah. Then she likes to have a cracker with just cheese and a chip on top. That's a, how she likes it. A cracker, it. cheese, and chip? Yeah. No way, that's funny. And another I cracker. Rory, I never knew that about you. Basically, you like a carb sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> when I was growing up, I always loved to put chips in the middle of my sandwiches. Do you guys ever do that? Like put chips in between, you know, with a little turkey, mayo. So anyways, I had this thought about this company that I wanted to make and it was gonna be called Chips in the Middle. You could get whatever kind of chip that you want inside of your sandwich. I could go on and on about chips in the middle. All these sand flies are still making me itch, ah! Uh, but basically, it makes your hands less dirty because you don't have to reach in and get all that flavor on your fingertips. You just have the chips on the sandwich ready to go and you can enjoy the taste of the sandwich and the chips at the exact same time. How awesome is that? Baby, should we start chips in the middle? Yes, we're gonna do it. How about chips and dip in the middle? How about that? Oh, that's taking things <laughs> to a whole new level. Rory is venturing off into the cold sea, guys. I am not going in there. It is too cold. Even though it's a hot, hot day, the water is freezing because it gets cooler at night. So then the water cools down at night. But of course, kids are going to be kids and they want to feel the water. Is it cold? No. <laughs> no? I think you're telling a little fib there, honey. It is freezing. Yeah. Run, run. Run from the waves. Run, hurry. Yes, you missed it. All right, we're going back in for round two. Okay, let's go, Rory. I got you. That one got you. Should we try again? Let's go. Oh, run, run, run. Good job. You missed that one. All right, last try. Will she make it, guys? You want to go deeper? Oh my goodness, you have to wait for summer for that girl. Mom's not going any deeper than this. Sorry, I love you, but I'm freezing. Okay, run! Oh, run, run! Run! She's running into the waves instead of away from them now. No, we're not going deeper and deeper today. It's too cold. We'll be freezing. What's wrong? You need help? Oh, oh, it's gonna suck you in. You better run fast! Enzo, you ate the Lunchable. Literally, even the plastic. All right, do you want to go on a beach walk? No, all he wants is salami and cheese and crackers. Franco, you're gonna go on a beach walk? Franco's ready. Boy. Boy.
are just about to pack it up and head home and one of the things that Tara and I wanted to do was send out a positive message today and so our message today to stay positive is to stay awesome look at that isn't that cool guys it was all done in shells and it just looks so beautiful and hopefully other people will come to the beach today and see that message and hopefully it'll make them feel better or brighten up their day the sun is about to set so we got to go home and give the puppies a bath Rory are you ready to go back home and give the puppies a bath yeah yeah we'll bring your truck <laughs> Benjo, Benjo, you ready to go home? You're tired, huh, buddy? We home. Let's go check on our Teasel Weasel. Where is he, guys? There he is, waiting right by the front door. Franco and Enzo are so happy to get home, but little do they know. It's shower time. I'm back in the car. Why do you ask? Franco ran away. Now I have to go and find him. Uh, he usually doesn't run away, guys. He usually listens and well, is well behaved. So let's go and try and find him. Hey, thank you. The neighbor girl found him, but now there's a car coming. Come on, Franco. Hop up, buddy. Come on. Get up Come here. On, Good boy. Oh my goodness. You almost got hit by a car and you run away, you little stinker. Franco was so naughty today. I'm so angry at him. But he's just a puppy, so what are you gonna do? Inside, time for a bath, bud. Time for a bath. Little Enzo Bindo's up for his bath first, guys. And he keeps licking the window because he wants some water. He does the best for bath time out of all the puppies. Diesel does pretty good too, but he really does the best. Franco does not like it at all. He tries to jump and run away every time. Thank you guys so much for watching Smelly Belly TV today. I hope you enjoyed our awesome beach day. But it is that time of the day to say our favorite parts of the day because that's the Smelly Belly TV way. And my favorite part of the day, hmm, I'm usually like ready and on point with my favorite parts of the day, but I'm at a loss. My favorite part of the day was creating that awesome shell art for you guys that said stay awesome. Remember that, stay awesome always. My favorite part of the day is that Enzo's gonna smell like a fresh, clean pup after this bath. He will, and I buy the puppy formula, which smells like a newborn baby. It so, does. Yeah, it smells smell like it, guys. so vision. Did you smell it? <laughs> Wash your face. Look how cute it is, guys. Oh, do you like that, buddy? Look at it. He loves it. Nice massage for you. <laughs> get that gross He's little trying beard. To get the soap. <laughs> His beard gets so crusty. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I'm so cute. My favorite part of was getting an owie. Getting an owie, really? What about a good favorite part of the day? What did we do today? We went to the beach, we picked shells. No, I will show you your own camera. Okay, I'll show your face in the camera. Now say your favorite part of the day. My favorite part of the day was going to the beach and pick up sticks and pick up shells and make the eat. Say so see you in the next one, guys. See you in the next one, guys. So would you rather for the day is would you rather bathe a dog or a cat? Uh, or go to the Leave it in the comments down below. Rory decided she wanted to be a super vlogger all of a sudden, guys. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching Smelly Belly TV today. And remember, we put out new videos every single day at 6 a.m. Eastern Standard Time with the occasional late video. It happens. We're all human. Nobody's perfect. So hit that thumbs up and that subscribe button for daily videos. And we will see you guys tomorrow in the next one. Oh, I almost forgot something. Eat your pickles, kids! Click up here to see yesterday's video. Click up there to see more vlogs. Click up there to subscribe and also click over there if you're feeling spicy. Also, check out our you, you Now, Musical.ly, and Instagram. You can always find us under Smelly Belly TV. As always, eat your pickles, kids.